All right, well, we're back for match two to about to begin. Probably just, uh, uh, well, definitely less than two minutes. So match one worked out for me pretty well. Either going to be up against this TPM guy ruiner or, or actually OG01 or Beethan. So we'll see. OG01 had a loss, so I would like to play him. We'll see. I, in match one, I wasn't on the play on either one of those uh, games, so we'll probably choose to play first to be a little more aggressive if we're given the option. Depending on what they're playing, we'll decide what to do for the second uh, game afterwards. All right, this one's definitely keepable, so uh, we will not mulligan. <laughs> sure he's not gonna make the exchange I mean it wouldn't be an exchange I would win but I just think he'd let my guy through I am contemplating throwing a madcap skills on him though uh, if he doesn't bring anything out next turn I could just keep going in With what I see right now, I think it's my best goal just to start start putting the hurt on in the beginning. I'll throw the guild gate out there as well. out in my favor so far. So we'll go ahead and go in for the swing. <laughs> See if he has any response for it. And it looks like he does. And I 
think we'll go ahead and get the static caster out there. So block. I'm going to go ahead and let him in for this one. <laughs> I mean, I could have blocked any force piece, man. Okay. Well, if at any time he decides to buff her, I can get rid of her. I think our best bet is just to bring out the halberdiers and the clue stone. And pass turn. Skylashers. I would just hate to have him toss a giant growth on that Skylasher. I think I'm going to go ahead and let the three in. If he does choose to buff the sprite, I'll just get rid of her. Which I don't think he's going to do if he's smart. I think the best bet is just to pass turn here. See if he goes in with the Wolf Rider, which I think he will. And I might just have to get rid of him in hopes that he has nothing to buff him with. So I can only see exactly six damage I can do to him. Well. I think I'd rather just go ahead and get rid of her now.
I'm going to risk it. Go down to nine. <laughs> But I think that was my best bet to get rid of that sprite before he buffed her. And it's either the sprite or the wolf rider, maybe. Getting rid of the wolf rider was the better bet. I mean, that is helpful right there. Uh, let's go ahead and... Because I'll have the mana for it, let's go ahead and get rid of the clue stone. I gotta kind of watch my clock here too, because I'm taking a good amount of time. If I bring out the Cyclops, it, I mean, he'll be tempted to hold everything back except for that Wolf Rider. Uh, I can't really afford to take any more hits, though. I might have to just sacrifice something. I'm going to go ahead and pass turn. And if he does choose to go in with either everything or just those two again, I've got a good chance of getting rid of the wolf right at least. Yeah, he's got protection from blue. Well, that'll save me four damage. Well, we know what we're drawing next. Unfortunately, I was just don't have a way out. I have nothing in my hand now. So I'll make one even trade here. And I'll lose another. Yeah, 
Yep, we're just hurt here, so... I mean, the swift justice could be helpful. Let's see. Uh, there's a few things that could be helpful. I should probably just get rid of this Nivagmus Elemental. I mean, I don't see where he could be helpful against this guy's deck. The first strike could come in handy. I mean, against him I do want to be pretty aggressive. Data caster might not be too beneficial either. Bring in my third Cyclops. I think we'll give that a shot. Looks like he's still deciding on what to sideboard for himself. I would like to play first, and this unfortunately isn't going to be keepable. Uh, it's better, but uh, we're just one blue or one white source away from being playable, so this one is pretty keepable. I do wish I was on the play, though. Or on the draw, I should say. <laughs> I do like seeing the paralyzing grasp in almost each one, each one of my hands, or at least somewhat soon. Yeah, pillow rest him.
I can get a blue source. A whole lot better. Of course, it's gonna hold back that Spire Tracer. Well, unfortunately, so far we'll be taking two damage each turn. I guess I want to exchange. Which I'm not really willing to do this early. Well, at least he got an island. is just really going to be f very helpful for him. I mean, at this point, getting rid of the maze glider, I think, would be my best bet. It's not going to be helpful to me at any point, anytime soon, or the Blast of Genius. But I could see the Blast of Genius coming in handier if I somehow get through this. Oops. I'm curious to see if he's going to start attacking with a few more guys. I know he's going to go in with the Drake. Nope, he's attacking with everything. Well, I'll see if he has an answer for this one. Yeah, well, it's pretty much over for me now. Yeah. 